When it comes to protective clothing for firefighting, it is imperative that the garments are the correct fit. Wearing the correct garment size is important to your personal safety and task efficiency. It also minimises the potential for heat stress, compression burns, discomfort, fatigue and loss of flexibility. What we look for when fitting personnel in their protective gear is freedom of movement and effective insulation by means of adequate airflow throughout the suit. By following the correct fitting process, we ensure that the garments are neither too tight nor too short and will provide the wearer with the utmost protection. Bodies come in all shapes and sizes, which is why our suits come in a variety of heights and widths. This design suit comes in five heights and seven widths. This enables us to achieve a perfect fit for everyone and generally eliminates the need for made to measure. However, we can also create a custom garment in special cases. When trying on your structural garments, try to wear similar undergarments that you would wear when attending incidents. Fitting the trousers. Start with the trousers first. Don the trousers and adjust the braces until the crotch of the trousers sits comfortably too high and it will cause restrictions and discomfort, too low and it can also cause restrictions and damage the garment. The trouser cuffs should not be dragging on the ground as this will cause damage and potentially a trip hazard. Ideally, they will sit between two inches and four inches from the floor. Remember, you will have boots on too. You should have enough room at the waist to fit two clenched fists into the trouser waist. Bend into a kneeling position to ensure that the knee pads are correctly positioned over your knees. If the trousers are too short or too long, adjust the size based on the height of the garment. If they are too tight or too large, Adjust the size based on the width of the garment. Fitting the coat. Leave the trousers on whilst selecting the correct coat size. Don the coat and fully zip the front closure. Seal the Velcro storm flap and place your thumbs through the thumb loops. Ensure there is adequate room around the torso. The coat when held from the storm flap should be able to move freely around the body. Standing straight with arms stretched parallel to the ground, your coat sleeve cuffs should be within one inch of your knuckles. Pull both arms forward into a self-hugging position to ensure adequate room across the shoulders and upper back. If the coat is too short or too long, adjust the size based on the height of the garment. If the coat is too tight or too loose, adjust the size based on the width of the garment. With the correct fit, the coat and trousers should provide overlap. This should be checked when lifting your arms outstretched above your head. The overlap should also be checked when bending over to touch your toes. If the garments do not overlap, you are at risk of exposure to hazards when attending an incident. If this is the case, reassess the length of the coat. Correctly fitted garments will help keep you safe, reduce the risk of injury and provide comfort while attending incidents. If you have any questions, please contact us. We are ready to assist in any way we can.